Butterflies are taking flight this weekend. The Butterfly Gardens of Wisconsin opens to the public today. We saw a spectacular sight yesterday as the butterflies were released to their new home. Fox 11's Chad Doran takes us there. Here we go. <laughs> Didn't stay though. Didn't want to stay. One butterfly after another found a new home at the Butterfly Gardens of Wisconsin Friday. A sanctuary north of Appleton that Jack Boyd has long dreamed of having. I've been always interested in, in nature and uh, enjoyed butterflies as a young, a young boy when I collected butterflies. Opened last year, Voigt says the attraction surpassed his expectations. We had 5,000 people last summer. We probably expect about 10,000 people this summer. Friday, Voigt, his wife, and other volunteers released monarch butterflies at the gardens. Voigt says the monarchs will multiply over the summer in preparation for an important migration south. Certainly the monarchs are very endangered, I believe, because right now, the monarch population is down about 90 percent. In addition to education, Voigt says the butterfly gardens are also on a mission of preservation. Our mission is really to encourage people to have backyard butterfly gardens. And by having more habitat, uh, I think we can increase the amount of monarchs that we have in this state. And volunteers say with the gardens opening to the public Saturday, that mission should hit home with visitors. I believe it's very important that people uh, know about butterflies and they're more important to people than what they even thought until something like this came along. The gardens also feature about 20 other kinds of butterflies. There are also walking trails to explore, where you too can have a hands-on experience with nature. In the town of Center, Chad Doran, Fox 11 News.